Hello everyone, I'm Dylan. Welcome back to Persona Festival. You looked at the title of the video and clicked on it. Bobblish! <laughs> What's up, Mrs. Bubblicious? <laughs> Sir, I pop balloons? What if questions? I throw a dart with the answer that I like the most. Alright. Then yes. Whatever abstract scenario we're thinking of, the answer is yes. So whichever I believe in or think of more would be right. What's this? If you had the power to turn into a giant or the size of an ant, Will, what form would you spend the most time as? <sighs> Man, if I was giant all the time, people would be like, Hey, why are you giant? <laughs> but if I was small all the time, I'd be worried about getting crushed. Normal. If you join this circus, what would I want to be? Clown. Ain't nobody want to be a land tamer. <laughs> oh, telepathy. Because you can fly with telepathy, can't you? With like your brain. <laughs> what is the most interesting? People, places, or things? A lot of people are boring. Places are boring. Things are kind of boring at times. What do I like the most, though? I like things. Things are cool. I don't want them invisible. If you can implant one belief in everyone's mind, what would it be? Nothing that feels wrong. I'm the supreme leader. Everyone is a good person deep down. Ah. Everyone's kind of a mean person deep down. I mean, work one year of retail, and you will see what I mean. <laughs> I'm the leader, baby! What future stick are you excited for? Mm, I would like friendship. What element? Earth. Earthbender, baby! What do you think will be the most important to you on your deathbed? Oh, that's a trick question, because Dylan will never die. Mm, this one. I guess. Out of those three. If you go back in time and give your parents advice before you were born, what would you tell them? This one. Make me more powerful. If you became the head of a New World Order secret society, what is your global goal? Mmm, that chaos in the middle, though. think there will ever be world peace. People are too angry. You begin reading a book and find out the story of your life until now. Do you keep reading? Ooh. I mean, just yes. Try to change it to avoid bad things? Probably. Most likely that one. You can have a 24 hour video supercut any snippets of history you want. Even before cameras existed, what do you pick? Mmm. The internet gets angry, and all of a sudden, major moments in your life with your ancestors, <clears throat> defining moments in your life that you may not have realized shaped you at the time. Historical religious events. Mm, can we surf board with Jesus? Surf board with Jesus! You're going to be hunted by a ghost the rest of your life. You can choose the ghost. Who do you pick? <sighs> I don't want a family member following me all around all the time. Why should you have a ghost? Why are you still playing the video games? Great philosopher? Oh, man, that'd be so boring. Later, I guess. Can I pick the leader, though? Pick one new ability. Know all languages, play all instruments, survive all challenges. I am immortal. If you had to pick, what successor would you want to face? Mm, war is boring. Famine or war? Hey, famine or plague? Plague. Ow! If I was a car part, what would I be? I'd be an annoying radio. <laughs> 
you're giving a paper person assist you for the rest of your life, what would you pick? Public relations agent, life coach, chef. I mean, I eat a lot of weird stuff, but I think I'd be... I'd be this one. Cause that'd be the hardest to do for Jolin. If my brain was a room, what would it look at inside? Hmm. The one that's scary and makes everyone worried about my life choices. <laughs> you... Wait, simulation theory. You and the people you like are real. Nah, we're all floating dust in a ball of fire. Mmm, I guess this one. We're already dead. Who's the closest character in Francis' story? It's not the warrior, that's for sure. Rezzard! GANDALF! An alien offers you to take a tour of the universe, but you can never turn to Earth. Would you go? Yes. Heck yeah, that sounds great! A witch change with an inanimate object. To break the curse, you need to get a hundred people to touch you. What would you pick? Mmm. <laughs> people are gonna be touching that cool statue. You know they're going to. A comfy chair? Yeah, but if you're in a comfy chair, you probably get only like one person to touch you and then like whoever they invite over. Money sounds like they'd be the best choice because it gets traded around a lot. But if you were turned into like a one million dollar bill, how many times are you gonna get touched? Probably a statue. So money is filthy. The dystopian future terrifies me the most. What that mean? Police surveillance state. We have that now, scarf resources. We have all of these now. I guess this one. What would say the same? I think my friends would change though, because they would be like, Hey Dylan, I heard you won the lottery. You got $5,000 I going to have? No. Those balloons never should have chance. Forward? Ooh. What is this one? Quick with this one? Lightning round! Gut reaction? Alright. Spray the dragon target with the director that best traps yourself. There's neither. All right. Can I have an example? I'm ambitious. I'm determined. I am not organized. Uh, any of those. I'm goal oriented. I'm intelligent. That one's more for me. Candid, neither. Neither. Visionary, I guess. I'm hardworking. I work hard at things I like. Mmm, confident. Oh yeah, that's like. I am persistent. Love me. Mmm, <laughs> neither of those. Talented because I'm amazing at life, I guess. I'm resourceful. Dylan always gets his revenge. Logical. I'm impossible. Protective. I just wanted to be pure. <laughs> mm, helpful, I guess. I am warm all the time. I have body heat syndrome. I'm relatable because I'm human. I am human like you, yes. I'm amazing at life, I guess. You can do whatever you want. I don't really care. I'm loving. Authentic. I am who I am. I'm honest. Sorry, but that dress is ugly. And you are ugly. <laughs> Dylan is a free elf. I'm loyal. I'm romantic, I guess. I come on, bitches. I ignore that one for right now. I'm bold. I'm creative. 
<laughs> I won! Nice shooting. Already done, sweetie? Sure. You got me figured out? Where am I gonna be? Pace your best now! I'm the boring, ordinary human. Yes. On the inside, you are boring! Oh. I haven't taken a good look at myself in a while, have you? I don't know. This will be fun. What am I? What the heck? <laughs> this is or no ordinary carnival. Certain transformative effects on people. Alright, what is it gonna- How awful is it gonna be? I'm a sheepman! I'm a little sheep! <laughs> Genuine connection with people. Everybody comes with ease and how open and accepting you are to everyone in the flock. You carry inside you generally such values and morals by the side as a whole. I grant empathy and compassion for everyone. People love me for my down the earth values of the world. The world is meaningless. I'm real. I am real human! The world is just in the woods. Pressure effect demise cruel if it was really shooting against a special land with their own life. Mm, yeah. Don't let fear rule your life. I'm not a victim! I'm not a victim! Yeah, me! You know what you'll see you achieve? Robot spiders? Hope you have fun. Also found something out about yourself. Feel to drop a comment on what animal you turn into. I'm so curious what creature you happen to wander by here. Who knows? Maybe it impact what new game I need to add to the festival. The way home was right up behind me. Whatever happens to you, I just want to let you know. Everything in life lives this moment today, and you are a valid individual. With you, our future world takes you. You will have within you a set of skills and experiences through unique perspective. My friend wishes that your road ahead may not be always be easy, but you carry strength to overcome everything you need to. Believe in me. Believe it. Good luck out there. I make an adorable sheep. Thanks. <laughs> ah! I wanted to be like a squirrel or a robot. Bubble gum drum! That's good. I liked it. Deep in the dell. Sponsors! Look at all those patrons. Just, just call me Jay. Let's go by Jay. My sweetie sheep. The end. <laughs> well, I am a sheep, I guess. As always, thank you for watching, and I will see you eventually. <laughs>